Today's librarian has new tools designed to help students become lifetime learners. No longer just a gatekeeper of books. No. Today's librarian is an educator. Today, all school librarians teach information literacy, work to be an instructional partner, are an information resource, and an advocate for children and for free reading. Let's take a look at each one of these. You know, in a sense, the librarian has been broken down and built back up and given new tools, rebuilt and made better. Experimental aircraft crashed, hitting Stephen Austin Elementary School. It caused a terrible shelving accident in the library. The librarian, Antonia Tejas, was secretly rushed to a U.S. Air Force base where she underwent an experimental life-saving procedure. The procedure enhanced her, made her better than she was. The bionic implants would allow her to hear students' needs clearly. Enhanced reflexes allowed for swift keyboard action. Her improved vision allowed her to swiftly pick out those having problems locating books or information. Her new legs would allow her to be two places at once. She has become a secret weapon in the fight for information literacy. She is the Bionic Library. Today's episode, A Day in the Library. anything about elephants. Well, why don't you try Google? There'll probably be something there. Okay. Using her bionic eye implant, the librarian can see trouble coming and help students find valid information. about elephants and even a reference you can print and photos. Thanks, modern librarian. Now that Harry Potter is done, I can't find anything else to read. The librarian's bionic ear allows her to overhear both student and teacher information needs. Are you interested in reading more about fantasy and magic? No, more about boys. <laughs> her enhanced arms give her superhuman reflexes to locate anything quickly. The machine types so fast, it's like lightning and yeah. thunder. There's nothing new to do on the computer. The librarian's enhanced brain kicks in, calling up a list of the most modern internet tools and tips. Not true! Have you tried wikis, blogs, podcasts, RSS feeds, Web 2.0, Second Life? And finally, for that difficult to please student, an added feature, a third arm. 